day eight, and I'm weighing in at 193.3. So, this was after my cheat day. I had my cheat day yesterday, which is on the seventh. It was a little refeed. I honestly didn't go too hard on my cheat day. Um, well, the foods I ate were pretty, you know, pretty bad, but I didn't eat too much of it, so. I ate a burger from Dairy Cream, which I work at with small fries. Anyways, I ate two slices of pizza. I ate a cookie and I ate ice cream. Like I said, I didn't eat much of everything. So other than that, um, I still feel really good. I still feel, well this morning I felt pretty lean. So I knew today was gonna be a good weigh in, uh, 193.3. So that's pretty good guys, we're on target. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys own I'm gonna play clips because I did weigh in the past two days but I didn't record or I didn't vlog much so I'm gonna show those two weigh-ins for sure and then uh, showing this weigh in like I said in another vlog body weight fluctuates um, from day to day like it, it's not it, it can go literally for a four to six pound difference uh, there's water weight, there's a bunch of stuff to take in consideration. Uh, just because the scale goes up does not mean you're getting fatter. Uh, fat loss is totally different from your weight. Literally, like, don't freak out. Just stick to your plan and everything's going to be fine. But uh, that's pretty much it. I'm about to take a shower, then head to the gym. I got chest and back today. Um, I'm going to kill it. I had legs yesterday. Uh, I only worked out for about an hour and 15 minutes because the gym was closing. Uh, but I had a really good, very intense, quick workout, um, and I got pretty, pretty sore. My the striations in my legs were, well, the veins on my legs were just popping. But anyways, um, I'm gonna stop that here, and I'm gonna pick up on the car in the car uh, when I'm going to the gym. Stay tuned. That's enough. Um, I'm about to go to the gym now. Like I said before, on my way in, 193, I'm pretty excited for that. Um, I got chest and back. I'm about to take my pre-workout and for breakfast, I'm gonna have a complete cookie. Now these are, are good, they're good, but you need to be careful with them because they do have a good amount of calories. Uh, a full cookie is 360 calories, and I'll show you guys. And there. It is 180 per half a cookie. But the macros are pretty good, just we gotta be careful with the calories. The calories, at the end of the day, are calories. Mm, come on, focus. There you go. There they are right there. If you guys didn't get them, you guys can pause the video and check it out. Oh crap, it is hot in here. No! I forgot my pre-workout. And we are now gonna take off. I gotta take my pre-workout because pre-workout doesn't hit you right away. It takes about like five to 10 minutes, maybe even a little bit more. Now nah, five to 10 minutes sounds all good. Um, so I take it before I take off. And it takes me about 12 to 15 minutes to get there, so I just figure it's perfect timing. So I get there and I just, I'm ready to go and I work out. For all my new viewers, thank you guys for tuning in. Uh, my girlfriend shouted me out on Facebook and my last video got 109 views, so that's good. If you guys are new to the channel and you guys are excited for this cutting um, video, like tips and stuff like that, make sure you guys subscribe and hit the bell button. Uh, so you guys don't miss any of my uploads. We're gonna get lean, guys, I'm telling you. I'm gonna teach you guys. These vlogs are gonna get a lot more in depth. They're gonna get a lot better. More tips are gonna be um, given and stuff like that. So just stay tuned and things will get better, don't worry. So yesterday was my cheat day. I wanted to talk a little bit about that. And a lot of people think uh, cheat day is taboo. A lot of people think that you shouldn't have a cheat day and blah 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 and I'm gonna get into it right now now here's the thing 
number one reason why people end up falling off on their diet, on their grind, on their journey, is because they overwhelm themselves. Not, I'm not saying that I'm overwhelmed or anything like that. I'm saying, guys, there needs to be a balance. You shouldn't go into anything really life changing and make it so hard on yourself. Okay, this is, this is what I mean. When you're entering a diet, a diet, you shouldn't see it as a temporary thing. You should see it as a lifestyle. You should see it as something you, you would be able to do for the rest of your life. Not just a couple of months, not just a couple of years. This is something that you should be able to do for the rest of your life. If you see it like that, and if you're going through it and you feel like that, then trust me, your journey, your experience is going to be a lot more enjoyable. It's going to be, you're, you're going to see progress. It's just going to be a great time overall. So don't be beating yourself over these super strict, low-carb diets. Don't be, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to knock any diets off. I'm, I'm not going to knock anything off. There's so many ways to go at losing fat. And I'm not gonna knock any off. Because different things work for different people. Like I said, there's not one way to do one, there's not one way to do this. There's not one cookie cutter thing to do in order to lose fat. There's the different ways. Whatever works for you, go for it. I'm not saying it's not gonna work. But in my opinion, you don't have to be so strict. You don't have you don't have to be count your calories, eat mostly clean. And, and work out and, and give it your all but like these I can't eat bread I can't eat like I, I don't know there's ridiculous like stuff out there in my eyes I'm not saying it doesn't work when I first started I did the whole low carb diet I did the whole can't eat bread I can't eat Anything with high carbs, I can't eat. I was going to the gym twice a day, once in the morning and once at night. And I literally would feel like I was gonna pass out. I felt dizzy, I felt like I wasn't, like I was just gonna pass out there at the gym. That's unhealthy, guys. That's your body telling you, hey, I'm gonna pass out because you're not feeding me right. You're not. No, you're not putting the correct nutrients into your body. Listen to your body, guys. Like, you know, push it, push yourself to the limit. You know, get out there every single day. Push yourself to to the limit, whether that be physical, mental. Just push yourself to the limit. But know when your body's telling you to stop, you need to sometimes listen. You you, you need to listen. So, back on topic. I got a cheat day. So damn early. Well, I make my cheat days on Sundays. <clears throat> and usually, back, I would say last year, 2017, in the beginning of the year, when I, on my cheat days, I would really go overboard. Like, I would, like, know what I wanted, and I would eat, like, a bunch of it. That's not what I'm going to be doing this cut. I'm going to be eating the things I've been craving, but I'm not gonna eat so much of it. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna get a taste for it. I just don't wanna go over too much over my calories. And plus, there's no need for it, so. <coughs> All right, well, I'm here at the gym already. Check it out real quick. Man, I need to stop putting other people's cars in my video. I'm gonna get again copyrighted. I mean, copyrighted. I'm gonna get striked on YouTube. Drink. He wouldn't even let it touch this thing. All right, I'm done. Just finished hitting chest and some back. I didn't do cardio today because I need to go because I only have an hour and 10 minutes to get to work. Wait, sorry. 40 minutes to get to work, an hour and 30, that's a lot. I have, yeah, 40 minutes to get to work, so I gotta head home, it takes me about 15 minutes. And then I have to shower, cook, get ready, and 
head to work uh, and I don't have much time but anyways I'm gonna be doing some cardio tonight with my girlfriend so I'm gonna record that just to make sure just to keep me accountable uh, just to prove to you guys that I am gonna do some cardio tonight uh, oh yeah if I haven't mentioned it yet my goal weight is 175 180 to 175 depending how I look at 180 I'm gonna go to 170 if I want to go lower I'll go to 175 if I hit 175 I want to go lower I might go 170 but I doubt 170 is pretty light I, I don't think I'm gonna want to go to 170 we're killing it out here I waited at 193 as you guys saw this morning and I feel good I feel amazing I did some deadlifts today I haven't done deadlifts in a while and I pulled pretty good today I just feel good I'm feeling good I'm on my way home I'm gonna get some food in me I'm gonna cook for work and we're just gonna we're just enjoying it guys but anyways I'm out for now I'm gonna, I'm gonna be driving well I'm already driving I shouldn't even be recording but anyways I'm out for now guys thank you guys for tuning in so far and if you guys are new to the channel again hit that subscribe button there's a little bell down there right next to the subscribe button hit that so you guys don't miss any uploads and stick with me on this grind Yo, what is going on you guys? Um, I am actually editing day eight of the cutting season vlog. I need to start doing outros. Another thing is I said in the video I was gonna be doing cardio that day and I did not. I'm being honest with you guys, I did not do cardio that night. Um, but I'm right now, I'm gonna close that vlog. I'm gonna upload it. I'm also getting ready to upload, sorry, to edit um, the day nine of cutting season and then i'll have that if i finish it tonight i'll have that uploaded tomorrow and i uploaded sorry i recorded a bunch of footage today um i don't know if you can tell i haven't even mentioned it but i'm on a little road trip with my girlfriend right now we're on vacation but i'm here i'm grinding i'm editing it is one o'clock in the morning i'm drinking some wine i'm having a good time i'm editing and um yeah so i'm gonna try to get this video up tonight i know it's one o'clock in the morning but i'm gonna get it up anyways so i can have the day nine vlog which is gonna be a good one make sure you guys go watch it because we do a home workout which i think you guys will enjoy but anyways after that vlog i'm gonna start i'm start editing the next vlog which is today and um yeah guys we're just grinding out here i'm trying to do the best i can with the time that I've got in my hands. But anyways, thank you guys for watching today. Leave a like, comment, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell right next to it so you guys don't miss any uploads. It's been your boy, enjoying the grind, and I'm out. Peace.